Hello everybody, Sky here, the Unaccompanied Miner. Thank you guys so much for joining me today. Today we are on the Whatnot server, more specifically on our little Mushroom Island, and uh, we are not ourselves, really. We are actually in my camera account. Hello everyone, hello. And we are checking out the now finished Creeper Farm. So, we've added a little bit of a face. It's looking pretty good. Um, so, it's not perfectly proportionate to a creeper face. Um, it's the way this is built, The because of this half slab up top and the, the thickness of the walls, it didn't work out that way. Um, so, I made it appear to be proportionate. And we've kind of got a little, a uh, couple imperfections, you know, every now and then, just to give it that uh, kind of organic look, you know. Uh, the mistakes happen when you're building, and it should be that way in Minecraft as well. Uh, so, yeah, we are flying around. Here's 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 the good old sky you know and love. Oop, oop, hello! Hello! Look, I'm, I'm Sky, the unaccompanied miner. Ooh. I don't know what that was all about. But anyway, yeah, let's check out the progress of the island, you guys. So I've been taking some time converting everything into this luscious, bright green grass. Um, we use the old uh, water over mycelium at night trick to uh, kill it all off and turn it into dirt, which allowed us to uh, have some grass spread. There's some bare spots on this side of the island, but uh, I'll just have to manually manually go in there with a couple of grass blocks and uh, encourage some growth. So we probably have, I don't know, a fourth of the island done? Maybe a little bit more, but uh, the where, where it's left, uh, however, is a little bit more difficult to get into s these nooks and crannies. Like down here I, I can't just use a water stream because it, it won't flow straight down it'll it, it's just a whole mess whole mess uh, but that's why it's a, a long-term project um, what else what else yeah let's actually move back to the creeper farm so we've got uh, our ourself right here uh, on the AFK spot let's go look at the uh, the internals now see what the spawn rates are like I think you guys will be quite impressed all right so as you guys can see, there are some creepers in our creeper farm. These cats have been the most cooperative. When I was making this, they were teleporting all over the place. Anytime a mob hit me, they'd like teleport to me. But now it's like they understand. They understand that their place is to be a cat and stand right here. <laughs> yes, they, they know their place. They're, 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 good, they're very good cats, very good cats. Uh, so the changes we've made to the farm, while you're seeing one right now, We've added some magma blocks to the water stream, so now the creepers are taking a touch of damage as they're being uh, pushed and funneled down here. We've added some lava blades that the creepers then get uh, pushed into. Uh, I've added these cobble walls, which, if you watch closely, uh, raise the creepers by half a block. That way they, uh, their heads always touch that lava as they go down. The reason we're doing all this is because we've actually reduced the height of the drop shaft. If you guys kind of recall, um, we previously had the farm collection down here underneath, uh, but now we've uh, got it actually in the body of the creeper, as you can see. Wow, that is a lot of squid. That is a, a whole heap of squid. And uh, all I've done is I put some magma blocks down here to ensure that no creepers uh, going to survive that fall and if they do they're gonna get uh, magma blocked underneath these are some uh, hopper mine carts just run into a line of hoppers and then into our new collection room I've just got some chests and a hopper line nothing too fancy uh, so let's get back into our main account and we'll kind of talk about our plans Oh, that feels so much better. I did not feel like myself. Not at all. Not in the least bit. Uh, so, yeah, you guys, let's talk about what's going to be happening. Uh, so, uh, we've actually also moved our uh, storage up here in the sky because uh, our next project that I've, I want to get done because, oh, geez, where are my manners? Let's, guy, let's catch you up once more. You guys are ready for this? Let's do a fancy pants dive. Oh, uh, spin, don't vomit, no one vomit. 
Ta-da! We have a beacon, and we've been doing some mining, everyone. So yeah, I did a wither fight off camera. Sorry about that, everyone. Uh, it didn't. It didn't seem like anything you guys really, really needed to tag along for. Everyone's seen a wither fight. But yeah, we've been doing some beacon mining because I needed to recuperate some iron uh, for all of the hoppers we're gonna need for. Wait for it. Wait for it. Our storage system, which is our next project. Um. So yes. Uh, the idea for the base this time around is we're going to have a big donut in the sky, right? Um, and in the center is going to be the storage room. So this platform that I've made right here, it's temporary, it's temporary, but it is in the location where the, don the donut hole will be, so to speak. And so around the donut hole will be three walls of a storage system, maybe a fourth wall. I, I don't know if that's a great idea but i mean hey why not um we'll mess around with it after we get three up um and so we're getting together materials for that iron is the big one for hoppers i'm gonna need a lot of wood for chests um i think i'll probably just be doing jungle or spruce trees for those let's actually put away some of this since we're gonna be out and about yeah 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 um where where, where was i who am i who are you? What are you doing here? Um, yeah, so we're going to be getting materials together, but what I thought would be interesting is if we actually got together the uh, dimensions for the, the room. So let's get some stone. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Do some fast crafting. Why don't... This should always be on. It's never on. Like this and like this. It's a really great thing, actually. We've been uh, beacon mining with Silk Touch because we're going to need a lot of stone for this project. So, actually, let's just start building this guy out just to get some working room, and then we can kind of visualize what what our uh, our storage room is going to kind of kind of be like. Uh, so, I'm going to get this built out, and then I will bring you guys back. I actually might even get the outer ring of the of the donut built. Uh, we actually have the dimensions kind of marked out, uh, but we've since moved our platform up. So I think I'll do that and then I'll bring you guys back. Yeah, 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 that sounds, sounds perfect. Okay, you guys, so we've made some pretty nice progress uh, on the on the planning and the plotting of the donut. I don't know if that's going to be the official base name, but it's really just the easiest way to describe it kind of in concept right now. Um, I'm doing the second inner ring. So we did in the in the time lapse you just saw, uh, we, we were just building that outer ring. Now I'm kind of plotting out. Uh, what the actual size of the interior is going to be and it's this inner ring right here um so hold on I, I can't lose track of where i am three three two this needs to be another three like this another two like that one two three and then just diagonal like that and all connected let us get an aerial view from the sky and beautiful <laughs> I don't wait is that it looks kind of wonky are you guys seeing that maybe it's just the distortion yeah doesn't it kind of look not circular I mean it is a circle I used a guide and everything it definitely looks more like a circle coming on horizontally but uh, looking uh, directly from above yeah buddy you you got some issues. <laughs> you got some issues to address, man. Uh, but anyway, we're not going to worry about it. Um, I'm sure all of the all of it's fine. It'll all make a very cool base. Nothing to fret about. Um, but yeah, I think what we've got to do next, you guys, is we'll take a break on uh, on base building. Uh, I, I know that um, 
you're anything like me, you're eager to get a little bit of the base built, the storage system, uh, but there are some more pressing matters at hand right now, you guys. Um, I'm pretty sure someone is after me. Someone is, you know, is trying to get me on the server, and uh, I, I need some help. I need some help doing some investigative work. Uh, so I've been in touch with uh, one of the other whatnots, uh, who I will not name at this time, for their protection. It's Sullivan. And we are going to uh, do some investigative work on uh, what exactly Kinky is up to and if we can stop him. So, uh, I think let's head over to the Whatnot Town and uh, join up with our, uh, our new ally. Okay, you guys. So, we're heading over to uh, converse with Sullivan. Um, we've got to talk about this Kinky issue. And uh, I think he's the, he's the guy to help us out. He's had some previous experience and might know what's up. Hey, Sullivan, how's it going? Hi. Hi. I'm here. Yeah. Uh, so, uh, Sully, do you know what, what I'm here for? Vaguely. I heard some terrible story about Kinky planning to tear down the sky. I'm not sure how you do that. Yeah, I mean, I imagine maybe... Do you use a pickaxe? What's, what's the most effective tool for mining air blocks? Uh, creative mode. Ah, perfect. Yes, I don't think he has access to that, so um, he probably has some sinister, sinister weapon or tool or something. Um, so, uh, Sully, why? Do, I hear that uh, you have some past experience with Kinky. Why? Why do you have a grudge against him? Well, uh, he did kind of abandon me once. Oh, what? Uh, he was supposed to be my leader in a in a war, and then he just he, he abandoned <gasps> us. So you're saying he's practically a traitor? practically <gasps> i mean it may have not have been his fault that he betrayed us but he he betrayed us oh it's basically the same thing mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. There, you know do you know what the difference between manslaughter and murder is yes this is murder <gasps> well it, it would have been that was attempted murder <laughs> but but it's all about no, i knew you i knew you had feather falling <laughs> it's all about intent man um, and I, I, I'm going to say he's intending to uh, take down the sky. So uh, we kind of need to come up with a, a game plan. Um, are you willing to help me out in kind of like a, uh, you know, a, a battle against Kinky? I'd be down. I mean, uh, the sky is superior to the ground. I agree. We also need I to mean, find out. Literally by the definition of the word, superior means above. Mm, I like the way you think. We also need to find out if uh, they, if uh, Kinky has any kind of a secret base or any kind of accomplices as well. So I say that we head over to uh, Kinky's area and uh, do some more snooping. Um, sure, I'm down for that. Um, I mean, if he does have any allies, allies, I'm sure they're beneath us. Ooh, yes. Is that a double entendre? Only time will tell. <laughs> <laughs> um, all right so let's get our our sleuthing gear together and do some investigative work sully all right excellent off we go off we go brb everyone okay sully so i think this is kinky's desert everything looks familiar yeah i haven't actually been here before okay well a fr fresh pair of eyes perfect so we're gonna get yeah. down to the bottom of wh what's what's going on over here um, I've seen it in his video, but like I haven't actually been here. He has a mailbox. Oh, here's your your gift. Yeah, I was given. I I I felt bad. I didn't want to take away the presents. Maybe peace offering. You know, if if this is you know some kind of a a quarrel he has with me. You know. Yeah. Um. I so know. you never know with this guy. What are we looking for exactly? Like I I don't know. Some kind of clue to Ooh. what his his plans are i mean let's let's root through his chest he's got diamonds wood building he's material. got a notch apple yeah he he was pretty Fortune fond theory. of finding the notch apples uh i know he's really into pvp I he's eating know. he's eating chicken oh a diet of chicken the diet of evil <laughs> wait you said he's into pvp is he actually I think so. I think he does a lot of uh, like mini game, like PvP mini games on his channel. Oh uh, yeah. Wait, what? What was that sound? What are you doing? Do that again. I don't know. I just, I just rotated and. Oh look, it's there's a. Thing oh over here. my gosh! 
What I, I don't know if I want to go down there, Sky. Sully, do you know what this is? So it's the co- the toe of Cavernog, right? That's the evil rabbit. Do you think that there's any kind of a connection? Should we stop using the toes? I I, I don't want to go down there. Uh, I don't want to go there. Uh, it's scary. I mean, it's fine. I, it's, we're not going to find anything. It's probably just like extra storage. Come on. Okay. Um, Secret storage. Oh, dear. Sully. <laughs> Sully. Uh, Sky. What? I think this might to be an altar to your death. I'm afraid to look in the chest. It's it can't be. I mean, it's some misunderstanding. A lot of people have that skin. Uh, what? What is it? Uh, I'm out. <laughs> Goodbye. Goodbye. So long. It's been good. I, Sully. There's if, an evil plot. There's an can, evil plot. If you can close there's an the evil door plot. behind you. <laughs> I close what? it. We're out. We're done. What We're done. What is that? I, I'm I'm going back in. I have to, I have to investigate more. What? I, I don't know. So, so what does this mean? Like, do you I think mean, he's, is it part of a cult? The real question is, how did he get your head in the first place? I think it must have been from Atlas, because Atlas killed you, didn't he? No, you're right. Atlas has killed me. But then again, so have you, so... Uh, <laughs> I, about that. <laughs> I'm, pretty, I'm pretty sure everyone has got has got a death on me on the server. Wow, this is... But but I'm your friend now. Yeah, yeah. You wouldn't do anything to uh to push my buttons. You're right. You're right. <laughs> um. Okay. Well, I mean, that's that's pretty incriminating. It's it's definitely clear he's up to something, and he he wants me dead. He he wants me gone from from the whatnot server. So the real question is, what are we gonna do about it? Well, I mean, Sully, I I don't know about you, but I for one. I'm always on the side of good and virtue. Um, I say we start our own our own group. We've got we've got to be the the superior men here. We, we yes, exactly. Uh, they are beneath us. We must be the the Ubermensch. Maybe no, no, per- no? perhaps, perhaps. What well, you know? Both of our our names start with S. Maybe we can do something something with that. Oh, that's a good idea. Could be the. Uh, survivors? No, that's Paul's thing. Does that that be? How how, how about how about s- working title? Saviors. The, we can be the saviors. The saviors, <laughs> perfect. We are of the good, the light. Yes, we the are light. the saviors. <gasps> perfect. <laughs> well, Sully. We're going to have to get some kind of a headquarters built. Um, uh, I have some things to attend to uh, for the rest of this episode, but uh, we're going to have to get together, come up with a headquarters location, maybe somewhere in between our two Mushroom Islands. And yeah, uh, yeah come up with a game plan. Kinky needs to go down, and anyone helping Kinky needs to go down. Exactly. Some, some underwater uh, headquarters or something. Maybe we can convert a guardian farm, Ooh, a guardian that- temple. <laughs> that that's that's a long term project, but I like it. Um, well, Soli, uh, thank you so much for your help. It's good to know I have someone I can trust on the server. Well, at least when we're working together. That see, and then you say things like that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, but anyway, anyway, uh, thanks thanks no, no. so much for your no, help, and, man. And in all official business against other members, I am your friend. But, there may be squabbling between us, but that is a different matter. I mean, uh, entirely. What friends don't have small squabbles? I don't know. I just turned your base into a jungle, so... What? <laughs> anyway, uh, I'll, I'll uh, talk to you later, Sully. We'll figure this whole thing out. All right. Farewell. Peace. Well, I hope you guys like that little collaboration we did with Sullivan Workshop. Um, I will be sure to uh, put a link to his channel down in the description in case you are not already subscribed to him. Uh, fellow whatnot, a fantastic YouTuber and all that jazz. Uh, but yeah, uh, we're going to have to, you know, just uh, continue to keep a uh, watchful eye on Kinky. Uh, we've got to get our... Uh, 
uh, Savior's uh, base all hooked up and, uh, you know, uh, central planning going around that. Um, I'm going to be getting some materials together for my base because in the next episode I'm going to I'm going to start on that dang storage system that I keep on talking about because now we've kind of got a working platform up there and such and I will have more to reveal to you guys uh, next time but with that being said that is going to be it for today you guys I hope you enjoyed the episode I hope you enjoyed the collab with Sully and uh, yeah I always appreciate the support always appreciate the likes any kind of uh, you know love you guys give on the videos uh, really appreciate it all the time uh, that being said I will see you guys in the next episode on whatnots goodbye <laughs>